What's going on, everybody? My name is Tiggs, aka Tiago, and today I am not bringing you a little Destiny gameplay. In fact, I'm bringing you a little bit of the Order 1886. As you'll see, 40 seconds left to go before we can load into this game. Um, really looking forward to it. We'll see how it goes. I've heard that the campaign mode is a little bit short, but from what I've seen in the trailers and everything, it honestly looks like enough fun that I won't care. Um, those of you that know me at all or have watched me play know I'm not huge on single-player games. I pretty much am strictly a multiplayer game gamer, uh, but I don't know. Destiny has kind of made me stray away from that. And uh, PvE, I guess, is still something I consider not single-player, but single-player in the sense that you're still playing in AI, not humans, and that's, you know, the big difference between what I'm used to. So I figured we'd give this bad boy a shot. Looks like a lot of fun. So here we go. I apologize if you hear my uh, chair squeaking, some stuff clattering around. I'm probably drinking some water over here. Uh, I don't record too many long form videos here, so uh, I might have a hard time dealing with that kind of background noise, but hopefully it's not too annoying for you guys. Shut up for a little bit so you can hear the game. Underwater or something here. I understand anything. I actually like subtitles in video games, which is a little bit weird. I know a lot of people hate them in movies and video games, but I kind of like being able to read it. Giving up the ghost now. Fancy an upper rant. This must be the whole thing about there's two factions and war and like that. Isn't that the basis of this story? That could be what's happening. I could Oh, it's just getting started. Not to worry. We'll come back and have another go later, aren't we? Right. No. Come, come on, get up. Up you get. Get up. <coughs> I don't like watching cutscenes too much, but I want to be able to know what's going on for when I'm talking about this game, and just because the story looks interesting. If the game's short in and of itself, I don't want to make it even shorter by skipping these cutscenes, I guess. Cheat myself out of it. single player game I truly enjoyed was probably Skyrim and obviously this is going to be nothing like that but that gives kind of an idea of how little I play single player games. Time for your morning bath, my lord. Excuse my coughing throughout the video as well. I'm a little bit sick. Hate planes, all the germ involved with air travel. Worst thing ever. If you guys follow me on my Destiny channel, you'll know I was gone this last week up in San Francisco visiting my girlfriend for Valentine's Day and her birthday. Got super sick over there. Been coughing ever since. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, not so hard, was it? Here we I've go. I tried pretty hard to resist the urge to skip this and start playing the actual game, but. You about ready? These things take time. Put him back here. So far, it's not much of a walkthrough, huh? Just watching your cutscene with you guys. I can do this all day, mate. Cut. Right, Look at that mustache, though. On. Let me know as well what kind of lanes you guys prefer. I know some people like, I don't know, huge 30 minute long videos, but I think we're going to stick with 10, 15 minute videos. I feel like it just gets repetitive, and with these long cutscenes, you're not going to want to just sit through all of that if you guys want to get the game. So, this first one might be a little bit longer because. That cutscene was obnoxiously long. We're seven minutes into the video and I just pressed three buttons, you know. But from here on out, when the gameplay starts to become more of a game and less of a movie, we'll probably go ahead and do 15 minute videos. Unless you guys want something longer. Uh, if that's something you guys are more interested in, let me know down below. You can definitely make that happen. I have no preference for the video length, obviously, but it's all about what you guys want to see. on the table right there. You can't pick those up. I hate that about, like, certain, obviously, those are, that's really hard to code, right? It's just being able to use the environment how you think you should be able to use it, but... You know what I'm getting at. When there's something that you can clearly use on the table or on the floor, and the game doesn't let you actually use it because it's not coded into it. I don't know, what do you guys think about these first episodes of walkthroughs? It's always just learning the very basic controls and cutscenes. When I ever watch, whenever I watch walkthroughs, it's always just skipping ahead to maybe the second or third video. <laughs> Obviously, you guys are more than welcome to do that yourselves, because we're nine minutes in and absolutely nothing has happened. <clears throat> Probably done a little bit more research on this game. Uh, tell you guys like what's going on here, who I'm fighting, who I might be. I don't know anything about this, honestly. That's more fun for me, anyways. Is just kind of going into this game. It looked interesting for the trailers, but as far as lore goes, I have no idea what's happening. That's the werewolf or something, right? I heard there's lichens or werewolf in this game. I guess. Cool, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. As I play this game, I'll probably learn more and more. But feel free to enlighten me down below in the comments. I know very little about this game other than it looks like a lot of fun. I 
hands up. All right, mate. Not a word. Inside. Close them. I don't know, I come from more of an SDS background too, so this whole third person shooter thing is going to be pretty weird. You're him, aren't you? The convict everyone's talking about. There's only one way out of here. Walking dead, that's where you are. Gonna wish you never left those catacombs. Such a mouth. Fair enough. Fair enough, it's your funeral, not mine. Move. He has a gun! He has a gun! Whoa, fellas, whoa! Job of not talking to the cuts. Sorry about that, guys. I just realized that's probably very annoying. I don't know how I feel about this so far. All we're doing is pressing the buttons that are prompted on the screen. It'll probably get better as we go along, but so far, that's a little bit. Give yourself up, monsieur. My next shot will not be a warning. Dressed in not red, right? So he must be from the other faction, I guess. That's one thing I do think I know is two factions. I don't know. Up on the roof! Hands where I can see them! The play is over, Galahad. Surrender yourself! Raise your hands now! Raise your hands! Oh, no, I was wrong. Hands up! Gray? Don't do this! I said surrender! He's gonna jump over the edge, right? Head. You have betrayed our order! No one may escape the penalty! You forget, Lord Chancellor. I'm as good as dead already. <laughs> I'm thoroughly confused, but I guess that's the point of these opening scenes, right? Is to get you hooked on this game. And not know what's happening at all. Galahad, come in. Galahad, acknowledge this is command. I read you, Percival. Enjoying a stroll in the park, are we? Nothing quite like a chilly London morning to stimulate the senses. Not to interrupt your little constitutional, but we have confirmation that multiple marks at Grosvenor Square. What are our directives? Rendezvous at the United India House with the Grain and Lafayette and contain the threat. Do you have it in sight? <clears throat> this is really nice looking. Right in front of me. Apparently I found Good. it, but I don't know what it is. Assess the situation once there and proceed with caution. Did Nicola provide you with armament? Yes. SXM2 Falchion. Good. The Falchion's secondary ordnance should help. Kind of 
point. Yeah. We may be pursuing Bedlamites, yeah. but they remain civilians. Use non-lethal force whenever possible. I guess it's the highlight Understood. of this game is the weapons. Are you joining so. us? I have a small matter to attend to. I'll find you afterwards. En route now. Got that out. I'm thinking of turning on the subtitles because I prefer them and because I found myself accidentally talking over the cutscenes pretty often. I want you guys to be able to know what's going on. Um, but if that bothers you, definitely let me know and I won't turn them on. And also, I can adjust the volume on the commentary so that you guys can pretty much hear what's going on anyways. But I guess it's also another preference thing. Something else you just have to let me know about, because on my end, obviously I can hear both things as well as my own voice, but it's gonna be completely different on YouTube. Morning. So feedback is always really appreciated. Oh man, this this first episode is probably gonna put you guys to sleep. None of you are coming back for episode two. You're putting me to sleep. It's three in the morning over here. That was probably a Ford one. Good day, sir. Rain. Rain. I'm on my way down to the street. Acknowledge. Let me just go down. Then. I thought we had to find someone to talk to in this building, but apparently not. We just head all the way downstairs. If I can. Am I already downstairs? Maybe I'm already downstairs. Parkour, parkour. I swore an L3 was a sprint, but he's walking 0% faster. That's another thing that's making this a little bit more boring than it could be. Painfully slow walk. Negative. Same here. He's probably off somewhere gallant at him. Being, well, himself. I know your concerns, but trust me, he's a good lad. Did you say so? In any case, I have no time to look for him. I'm assigning the last few constables to their posts. All right. I wonder if any of that's going to be important later on. made a wrong turn and now I can't walking this slow it's so painful all I can say is that we've asked everyone to remain inside their house uh, who is Ukraine All right, as soon as we find a game, we'll wrap this one up. Hopefully episode two has actual gameplay. 
hands, clearly. not just crawling through the streets what of, needs a glass of water? whatever this European country is, is probably in Pressing a few buttons that are showing up on the screen. I imagine this game will get better. I, I hope it'll get better. A lot of games start off slow, right? But hopefully they pick up sometime soon. Galahad! See that you cordon the entire district and do it quietly. How did you arrive here so quickly? Skill love. I must admit, you do move fast for a man of your age. And I cares to be reminded of his decrepitude by a fair damsel. My lord, this damsel would never be so callous as to do such a thing. Sure is he. Would you ever? <laughs> Who are the marks? Bedlamites running amok. Percival thinks it could be a rebel subterfuge. Let's hope you haven't lost your edge. Remember who trained you? He was the best. In his day. Was. You're still pretty good. But I'm better. Banter. Big rain. Come in. Acknowledge Percival. Multiple escapees spotted at the east entrance of the United India Underground Station. Intercept with caution. Understood. Come on, Gray. Let's move. Please don't run so that I can stop this video right here. Alright, if I stop, will you stop too? Well, we'll catch up. Alright guys, we'll catch you in the next video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave any and all feedback down below, please. I'm new to YouTube and even newer to Let's Plays. Just thought this was a cool idea. I really wanted to play this game. May as well show you guys what it's all about in case you're interested. But obviously, 100% open to feedback, comments, you know, the likes. Um, you know, positive rating, everything helps out, help the channel grow. If you're interested in some Destiny content, make sure to check out my main channel. Link will be in the description as well as on my channel. And if you're interested in the next episode, I can't put a link to that yet, but it's being recorded right after this. Make sure to check back in a second. It'll be up right away. Talk to you guys next time. And as always, I don't have the bark sound effect in this program, so I can't do it. <laughs>